At the beginning of training camp, uh, all the players met at our home rank that we call the fort. And coach basically just gave us an overview of, you know, how the season's going to go. After orientation was over, we all piled in the locker room and got to see our lockers for the first time. With our jerseys, t-shirts, hats, uh, you know, we got everything. After we got that, we took our player headshots for the league website, and then we were ready to go start training camp. So... Our ice wasn't ready for us to skate on yet, so we had to go to Oswego State University to use their ice. And so we dropped our gear off at the rink. We had to walk a mile back to the rink. At the college, we had two hour-long ice sessions uh, where they just bag skated us and beat us up. And then we had two off-ice dry land conditioning sessions in between. Day two of training camp, uh, we got up and we packed up the car and we headed to the fort. Uh, that's where we kept our gear overnight. After that, we drove back to the college, dropped our gear off, had to walk the mile back again. Since there was only student parking all around the rink, we weren't allowed to park at the rink. So that's why we had to do all this walking. Went back in the locker room and got ready for our first hour-long on-ice session. And right after that, we had an hour-long dryland conditioning session. Now after those two, me, Trent, and Hayden we went to Subway, fueled up for another session of off-ice and another session of on-ice. Now day three of camp didn't exactly go as planned. So what happened was we were all supposed to go back to the college and skate there. But since we were all using it between our team and the college team, we ended up tearing up the ice really bad and the ice rink's compressors actually ended up going out and blew out. So the ice wasn't ready for us to play and the ice at the fort wasn't ready to play. So on day three, we were only able to have two hour long dry land sessions. So on day four, we loaded up the car and headed to the fort. On day four, our ice was finally ready at the fort, so we were able to go to our home rink and have our first skate as a team. We had an hour-long ice session, then an hour-long dry land session. After those two, we had a little short lunch break, and then afterward, we had another hour-long session with an hour of dry land. Day five was our last day of training camp. We all headed out to the fort and it was the same setup as day four. We had two hour long ice sessions with two hour long off ice sessions in between. So coach was working us really hard. We were doing a lot of different skills, uh, drills and everything. Afterward, our coach's wife had a big, big lunch planned for us and that was the end of training camp. All right guys, so that was the training camp video. It was a little bit tough for me to get footage of everything that we were doing, obviously because I was doing those things. Uh, like the dry land, it was kind of hard to, you know, take my phone out and record some stuff while I was doing that. And uh, obviously on ice, I wasn't able to record anything because I was um, participating in, in training camp. So training camp went really well. Um, it was it was a grind, it was really, really tough. Uh, they absolutely beat the shit out of us the whole entire week. And um, we had, like you saw in the video, two ice sessions where we were pretty much bagged every single every single uh, ice session. And when you're bagged, if you don't know, that's you're constantly skating. They just pound you into shape, basically. And uh, everything off ice, we did a lot of stretching off ice. And then um, along with that, we did some, you know, sprints, some core work, some planks, a lot of planks, push-ups, uh, burpees, squats, just squat jumps, you know, everything like that. So really, really working us out and really, really putting us to the test here. So, um, but the team's looking really, really good and, uh, we should be in for a pretty good season this year. And, uh, now everyone's in shape. So this was just kind of a quick upload. Um, just kind of give you guys a run through of what we went through in training camp and, 
Hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. Next weekend, uh, we're going up to Maine for our first two games of the season. So I'll be recording as much as I can for those two games. And I'll be looking online to get our highlight reel kind of footage off of um, Hockey TV. Probably can put some highlights into the videos. Of, so like some in-game highlights for you guys to see. Hopefully you guys enjoy the future videos. Um, I'll be getting as much as I can on video for you guys. And if you guys enjoy the video, leave a like. Um, if you want to see more content and and would like to follow me along on this trip make sure you hit subscribe um i'm gonna try and upload pretty much every week now and uh during the season and hopefully you guys can get those videos if you guys want to subscribe you can click right in the middle of this screen and uh two videos will pop up in the corner for you to click on and yeah guys thanks for watching uh this has been danny michael i'll see you guys in the next video